Hello and welcome to PLZ Soccer's Thursday Morning Bulletin, brought to you by Indigo Communications. Scotland's World Cup qualification hopes were dented by a 2-0 defeat to Denmark last night, as two goals in two first-half minutes cost Steve Clark's men. The manager claimed the hosts blew them away with their intensity. Difficult first half for us. Uh, I think the Danish team started really well. Uh, good, good intensity, good power and pace. And we had to try and weather the storm and we couldn't do that. Captain Andy Robertson started in a right wing back position to no avail and Clark later admitted he got the shape wrong before changing it at the interval. An approved second half is something to build on for the Scots heading into Saturday's home match with Moldova. The next fixture, now Clark's focus. We're still in the group, no problem. We got a tough game at home against Moldova at the weekend and we, we, we go for three points. We get three points there then we, we look forward to the, the Austrian game away. But first focus is Saturday, we, we have to get three points. Glasgow City's hopes of reaching the Women's Champions League group stages are in their hands after a well-earned 1-1 draw against Savet in Switzerland. City went behind in the second half, but level through an outstanding Claire Shine volley. The second leg is at Broadwood next Wednesday afternoon. And elsewhere across last night's European qualifiers, Cristiano Ronaldo has become the all-time top goalscorer in men's international football after scoring two goals in the last two minutes to snatch victory away from Ireland. It takes him up to 111 goals and the Portuguese is the best player of all time, according to new club teammate Harry Maguire. For me, the, the greatest player to play the game, so you no, know, it's amazing to have him at the, at the club and um, I'm sure he's going to have a huge impact on and off the field and, and many players can look and learn and, and improve and then obviously he's going to improve our team as well with, with his goal scoring record so no it's, it's amazing to have him at the club. Thanks for watching and don't forget to tune into the football show it's on tonight four o'clock exclusively on the PLZ Socket YouTube channel we'll be discussing last night's game we want to hear from you as well so make sure you join in and send us your comments.